Hey, welcome back to Smithy's over 100 golf courses in a year. Today it's Sunday the 17th of April 2022, Easter Sunday, and we're on a wee trip round the west of Scotland for a, a few days. Uh, and we're uh, I've come to Belle Isle Park in here. I uh, used to come here on the golf trip many, many a time, so I played here quite often, but uh, not since about 2009. So, nice sunny day. The golf course is quiet because the Rangers Celtic game's on this afternoon. So let's go and see what it's got. Ladies and gentlemen, it's course number 33 of 2022. It's Belle Isle Park on the tee. The man returning to his native Scotland. But when he goes back to his house in England, will his next game of golf be in Rwanda if he's deported as an illegal immigrant from Kirkintilloch in Scotland? Smithy! Hey, first tee at Belle Isle. 451 yards, par 5. Right down there in between the trees and it's going to dog leg up slightly up to the left. Second hole at Belle Isle, playing back down, adjacent to the first. Uh, it's a long one, 458 yards and it's a par 4, it yeah, shouldn't be allowed. That's a look down at the second green. So it's a big long one for a par 4. Coming downhill now. The third at Belle Isle, first of the par 3s, 143 yards. You can see it's uphill, not too keen on them. I always find this all really difficult. Bunkers protecting the green at the front, so it's going to be a big long one to fly over them. Fourth hole, 390 yards, uh, dog leg to the left slightly between the trees. Here's the fifth at Belle Isle, 387 yards. Uh, starts off flat and then it's rising up a wee bit. Here's a look down six, 391 yards. Yellow keys are about 50 yards to the right of the white and reds. Coming at it from a different angle, a few bunkers there, uh, pins downhill, looks nice. 7th at Belle Isle, second to the par 3s, 139 yards, protected by the bunkers at the front and there's a road at the back. Strong wind behind us so there's not much room for error in this one. 8th hole at Belle Isle, par 4, 328 yards, so shorter one. Most of the par 4s so far have been uh, quite long. Just coming to the end of the first half, it's the ninth hole at Belle Isle, 309 yards and it's gone up the hill. Par 4, can't see the flag. Start at the back nine, tenth tee at Belle Isle, uh, 175 yards, par 3. Bunk, big bunker protecting the front. Seventh at Belle Isle, 407 yards, par 4. First of three par 4s that are all over 400 yards. Uh, so it's going to be tough for me. Uh, this is memorable for me because in 26 years of coming on our annual golf trips, this one is one of the only two occasions where I've hit the longest drive. I think everybody else was in the trees or the bunkers. Well, it's only Belle Isle, 406 yards. Dog leg to the right. Straight down and it's going to turn to the right a bit. Par 4. And after roaring round the front nine in an hour, uh, it's a wee bit slow on the back nine, quite a few players ahead of me now. It's a shot down to the green, and that's the old clubhouse in the background. We had the nice fire bar there when we used to come on a golf trip here. I don't know if there's a fire, or uh, there's no roof left on it. And that was a grand old building. And uh, if I can focus a wee bit closer down, there's a smithy ball just in the edge of the green, so First time today, I never thought I'd hear me saying it, but the opportunity. 13th hole at Belle Isle, 422 yards, par 4. Flat to start off with, and rising up to the, the green. Par 3, 14th, 182 yards. Bunker sitting in front of the green. That's a raised green. Long way it looks. Looking down the 15th at Belle Isle, it's another big long one, par 4, 426 yards. A wee bit of wind behind, I think, so assisting. Slight dog leg round to the right, but just a just a tad. Uh, two ball in front of me are giving snails a bad name. Yeah, I don't know what they're doing in the next tee whenever I get there. I think they're having a UN peacekeeping conference, I think. That's the 16th, 389 yards. Uh, it's going to be a slightly to the right after there's a stream down there somewhere. Last par 3 at Belle Isle, the 17th, 129 yards. Got a stream running in front of it, a couple of bunkers to the right. 
bridge there, that's a nice hole. Last hole at Belle Isle, 18th, uh, just over 500 yards, par 5. That's a tough one into the wind at the moment. The wind's swirling about everywhere, but at the moment it's coming out of my face. This is a look down the 18th from the fairway. Nice backdrop there. Still a way to go. That's me just finished on 18 at Belle Isle. I'm probably unfairly comparing it with when I last played it, which was over 20 years ago. Uh, I was part of the hotel then, and I think there's a lot more money and resource ploughed into it back in those days than there is now. It's part of South Ayrshire Council. But you see, that course is still in nice condition. It's a parkland course, but it's bone dry, it's at the seaside, so plenty of wind drying it out. Uh, a lot of big, long, tough par fours on the course. It's a par 69. It's over 6,000 yards, so it doesn't really suit my game, one for the big hitters. Not a lot of uh, danger of the tee, big wide fairways, uh, but for me the problem is the, the distance. Not being a big hitter, I find it tough to take quite a lot of the greens in two, especially into the wind. Uh, wind swirling about today. Uh, greens are not bad at all. And uh, what am I going to give it? Uh, let's see now, it'll be a 7.5 for me. Thank you very much.